Learn Chinese characters. Lesson two. Basic strokes. One. Hong and Shu. Today we will learn two basic strokes: horizontal stroke Hong and vertical stroke Shu. The Hong stroke is written horizontally from the left. To right, right. It is very simple. Let's look at a few characters that are comprised of this stroke. The first is the character for two, R. It consists of two horizontal strokes with the bottom line longer than the top one. When you write this character, go from top to bottom. We finished writing the character for two, R. Perhaps you are not thinking, it three just three hong strokes. If so, you guessed correctly. Now let's write the character three, sun. The rule is to go from the top to bottom. The middle stroke is the shortest, while the bottom one is the longest. How was that? Don't you think it was really easy? Okay then, let's practice the shu stroke. It is written vertically from top to bottom. Okay, let's practice some characters. The first is the character for ten. Shu has two strokes. The horizontal stroke hong. Is written first, followed by the vertical stroke shu. It looks like the cross on the top of the church, right? Next is the character for work, gong. When writing this character, we still go from top to bottom. First, the horizontal stroke hong, then the vertical stroke shu. And lastly, another hong stroke. You possibly already noticed that when writing Chinese characters, we need to follow some rules. Today, we introduce the two of them. The first rule is horizontal strokes before intersecting vertical strokes. Let's review the character shi, ten. The second rule is top before bottom. A good example for this rule is sun three. Let's review this character sun. All right, that's all for today. We will talk about other strokes and rules of stroke order in next lesson. For more useful conversations and culture tips, please check out our website, www.ninghao.com. We are in Beijing, waiting for you to join us.